Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. So in this video tutorial, we will learn about how to draw a triangle within CHGGY. So how we can do that? First of all, we need to click on File, go to New, go to Project. And here we have we need to select Visual C hash, then Windows and then Windows Forms application. You can also change the name of the project if you want. Click on OK and it will lead us to the working window of the chash.net. Now this is our working window. We will go to toolbox, take one push button and double click on it. It will uh, give us the callback function and whenever we will click the button or anyone will click the button, all these statements within these brackets will get executed okay now now we will try to uh, dry triangle so for it uh, we will use a class that is called as graphics okay graphics and we will make an a variable okay graphics uh, with the name plane Graphics is the name of the class and plane is the variable of that particular class. You must know that what a variable is. Okay, variable is any uh, variable names can be changed. We can change the name it to plane, plane one, plane underscore zero, or anything which you want. But graphics is the class and it is the uh, key class to draw anything. Okay. Now we will we will write the object the variable. Okay. This is the variable of that particular class and we will write plane is equal to this dot create graphics this dot create graphics now what is this this dot create graphics now what is this thing now plane is equal to this dot create graphics this actually represents the current class this actually represents the current instance of the class which is class windows forms application 12 dot form 1 okay and dot create a graphics is the function inside that particular graphics class and now both are now all this is all these informations are inside this plan variable or object okay okay now this is our first thing this is our graphics portion and we also need one brush class okay so we will write solid solid brush and brush and uh, oh, sorry brush okay now what is this solid brush is equal to new solid brush why we have written this thing why we have written this thing solid brush is equal to new so because whenever we want to make an object of a particular class then what we need to do is to what we need to do is to write the word new with the particular class again i am repeating solid brush is the name of the class and we want to make an object of that solid brush class and then we need to write new solid brush and it will make this brush variable as the object of that particular class and why we are going to make it because we want to fetch certain functions which are which lies inside this solid brush class so we also need to give like a color dot blue color dot red or blue or pale violet red or anything okay this is the parameter this is the para meter uh, parameter brackets and uh, we we have given it in the the the, the property okay color dot pale white pale violet red okay now now we will now we will go to make uh, or declare three points because for triangle we at least need point three points and we will join them so we will go for point class we will go for point class which is actually an error type thing okay points point this and points this is the points okay and we will draw these uh, uh, curly brackets okay now points is the variable of that particular or field okay we are not going to say like variable okay now it is better to say field okay fields are just the variables okay which which belongs to just uh, 
which belongs to just particular class okay so point points is equal to okay now we will write new point okay now why we are going to say this new again we are making an object again we are making an object new point 10 comma 10 10 comma 10 new point 10 comma 10 new point 10 comma 10 okay and comma new point Ten comma ten. Now what is this? Again the new word. Okay, again this new word is just for is just for to de to declare anything as object. Okay, so new point ten comma ten and point is our class. Point is our class. New point ten comma ten. New point ten comma ten and new point. 10 comma 10 okay now what we need to do is to give certain certain points which will make uh, us uh, which will make uh, a triangle for us so 0 10 comma 10 100 comma 10 and 50 comma 100 50 comma 100 these three points are for to make a triangle but actually all belongs to points field okay all belongs to points field okay now Whenever we, we will write anything, all these informations are everything is now stored inside this variable or field points. Okay, now we will use a function that is called as uh, sorry, eh? yes, surface dot fill polygon. Now it fill dot fill polygon. Okay, sorry, plane, plane dot plane dot fill polygon. Now plane is our obviously plane is our variable of graphics class and fill polygon is also a function is also a function okay function okay so brush comma points brush comma now we have written this thing why we have written this thing because fill po polygon we know that uh, fill polygon is a function which will take two parameters variables is parameters and uh, points have stored some information and brush also has to draw the uh, lines between the points okay so dot fill polygon is our function and plane is this uh, graphics class okay so uh, because uh, if we do not use these variables then we have to write a lot of things okay so that is why we just use these variables objects and all these things so now we will run it out okay wait okay now now wait 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 we we have to move our button push button here and now we will run it out now now you can see that we have made a uh, triangle in ch so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe